Hi, Karen Money Williams here, sitting in my living room where we have every first and third Friday and Saturdays an Abraham Hicks discussion group right here. And sometimes we fill this whole place up to capacity. And that always is so fun because we talk about the teachings of Abraham Hicks, which I happen to adore. These are the Abraham Hicks Law of Attraction card deck. And they, they comprise the card deck. They are the individual cards. I like to get my grammar just right. I'm kind of a stickler about that, although you might not know it. Anyway, as per usual, I'm going to shuffle these cards like so. I'm going to pick one out, and I'm going to pontificate about it. And this one says, My life is unlimited in every respect. My life is unlimited in every respect. Now, as the saying goes, that takes a little while to wrap your head around that. But this is what Abraham teaches us, and this is what we can know. And the more we ponder this, the more our life will become the joyous creation that we meant it to be when we came forth into physical expression. So, this means that there is nothing, as Abraham says, we can't be, do, or have. That means if you have a dream and you will take the, the time and self-discipline to think less about your limitations and less about why it couldn't possibly work and less about why other people say it can't work and spend more time thinking about your dream then there is nothing you cannot experience so th the same is true I mean no matter what your dream encompasses if it's finances if it's improved health if it's inventing something that will have a dramatic effect on humankind if it's being able to um, travel the world and experience a wide variety of cultures and and maybe have a positive effect in all of that if it's to share your humor to share your writing to share your videos such as I'm doing right now that's one of my dreams and voila here we are there's nothing you cannot do but you there's one big thing you you've got to let go of and that is thinking of your limitations as I referred to earlier if you just really focus on that dream and keep keep allowing focus on it generally and then allow the details to come to you little by little by little by little do this all mentally don't concern yourself about the action for a while just and and often keep it to yourself Jerry Hicks uh, learned he said that he learned years ago if he had some kind of a great uh, aspiration or dream not to be t uh, telling it to naysayers right off the bat because often they will just do what they usually do they'll tell you why it can't work and why you're just a dreamer but what you want to do is really think about where you want to go and there's no limit just know that know that deep within your soul right this minute no limits toodaloo Karen Money Williams checking out